This video is partially in collaboration with Drop. They make this gorgeous, amazing, beautiful <laughs> cold press juicer. If you're interested in picking one up, I do have a discount code. It's Tori50. We'll get you $50 off your juicer. Honestly, I love this thing. If you stay tuned till the end of the vlog, I go completely into depth. We make a juice. It's a really good time. And I honestly think you guys will love this. Like, I'm obsessed. And... I can't wait until summer, but anyway, without any further ado, I'll let you get into the vlog and I'll see you again at the end of it. Sometimes I just... Oh, good morning everybody, welcome back to my channel and to any vlog. I just finished up at the dentist. Funny little story, had to go there two weeks ago. Well, I didn't have to, but I wanted to. I wanted to go get my teeth clean and like just have a checkup. And I did an x-ray and a bunch of other stuff. Anyway, I had to come back for filling this week. So that's all done now. But I hadn't been there for 10 years. You went to go to the dentist like every six months. How crazy is that? Anyway, it is uh, Thursday morning and I've just pulled up out the back of the gym. I'm going to head in. Uh, for something I've never done before and I'm really actually scared a little bit but basically the gym's putting on the Les Mills body pump class again and Sam is instructing it this morning so I'm gonna go give it a go I'm a little bit scared only because of my shoulder the bursitis in my shoulder is still flaring up all the time even though I got the body steroid injection in the back of my shoulder it's really just not helped at all but Posy vibes, gonna go in, not gonna put a crazy amount of weight on the bar, and I'm really just gonna cross everything that I'm, oh my god, how awkward. <laughs> I'm really just gonna cross everything that there's not a lot of like leaning on the bench because that really just does my shoulder in. So, anyway, let's go in, be that girl in the gym with her camera sitting on the floor. You guys in there. Oh! First, but first, I actually need to buy more of this. Um, we need to get caffeinated. I have a headache, and this is why I'm realizing. So I've been awake since like five, and it is now quarter to ten, and I've not had any caffeine. So I'm just gonna be really gross and dry scoop this. I've been having it lately, like a normal person with water, but sometimes you just gotta just do it. <laughs> All right, we are set. Now we can go. All right, uh, so far nobody else is in here. That's fine. I'm just gonna set up with kit. <laughs> Here goes something. Alright, so standing at your bars, ladies, we're going to take a nice big shoulder roll and then we're going to take our hands into a wide step position.
home, <laughs> partially dead. I really just was not ready for that class. Like, <laughs> I'm usually a grit strength gal, so I don't know why I thought I would be able to do body pump. It's really like, there's a lot of like endurance stuff like that. And it's just not my strong point. And uh, a lot of like shoulder work, which I think I said I was a bit scared for, but it was definitely in there. Surprisingly, my shoulder feels fine right now though. But anyway, back home, I've got a load of washing on, fire going, I've just given the kitchen a quick once over, and made myself a cup of tea for my Christmas mug. <laughs> and I'm just going to, gonna be making pumpkin soup for dinner. So I'm just gonna chop up this entire thing and roast it in the oven with the skin on and then in a few hours from now when it's cooled down i'm just going to peel it and um throw it all into a pot and i'll show you guys how to actually make soup but yeah that'll be dinner tonight super easy dinner and then i'm gonna have a bath because i really want to take this tan off it's like so patchy and really disgusting um because i'm gonna go hey i'm gonna go sit in the sauna at the gym this afternoon Gonna go sit in there with Sam and uh, get our sweat on. But yeah, I'm gonna do this, have a bath. grease ball i'm also marinating <clears throat> excuse me <laughs> i'm also marinating in another coat of tan because i didn't use my usual one last night and i feel like well hello pile of dishes it's fine they're clean um sometimes i just put them on top of the oven because i don't really like them drying on like the wooden bench top freaks me out a little bit but anyway i feel like the one i used last night just didn't really like work out like you know when Obviously, they don't develop straight away, but, you know, when you just know that they're just not going to work out. Anyway, it's a new day. I'm just about to hang out a load of washing, and then I have to go back to the dentist, which is a 40-minute drive. I'm not very happy about it, and I'm really not happy to be missing out on the gym classes this morning, but I feel like my body probably needs a break from jumping around anyway. Uh, but there's just, like, this little bit of my tooth. I didn't feel it yesterday when she'd finished, but it is, like, a little just like hanging off the side of my tooth and I need to go back and get them to file it. I was naughty last night and filed it a little bit with a nail file which I googled after I did it and I shouldn't have done that so 
anyway it still just needs to be like smoothed and I'm probably not going to tell them that I did that with a nail file <laughs> So we got going there and just grab a few things because Clay and I have been making a little list every week, uh, like planning oh. our dinners. Oh my god, Dwayne is not about to start playing with a squeaky toy, which in turn has saved me a lot of time going to Woolies all the time. Um, effort making food that we don't need and money buying buying food that we don't need. Like it's crazy how like actually beneficial it's been for us. Cleaning our meals. But anyway, back to what I bought. A whole bunch of eggs, because Clay's parents' eggs have not... Uh, the chickens have not been laying eggs. So, anyway. Uh, I also picked up a whole bunch of stuff because I recently got a new juicer, which I'm going to show you guys in a minute. I'm going to have a shower and stuff first, but... Anyway, yeah, a whole bunch of fresh stuff. We've got baby spinach. Ginger, cucumbers, green apples, and celery. Uh, what else do we have? Some things for dinner tonight. I needed to get a whole bunch of spices. We got garlic powder, oregano, smoked paprika, and onion powder. Some salmon with the skin off because I can't be bothered to just cut it off. Clay's really good at like filleting fish, but. I'm not. Plastic curls because they're honestly the best things ever. Hash browns to go with my new favourite breakfast, which is poached eggs. Hash browns. Wilted baby spinach and hollandaise sauce. It is just the best thing ever. Um, and body wash. And that is everything that I picked up. I'm going to pack this stuff away, have a shower, maybe put some makeup on and transform myself into a decent human and then I'm going to show you guys my juice up because I'm really excited about it even though you've probably already seen it um I haven't used it yet I can't wait I'm so freaking excited about this so this is a cold press juicer from drop yes yeah, so a difference between a cold press and like a traditional juicer which is what I've used for years is that these bad boys are bladeless and in turn they don't create any heat or friction which is going to keep a lot more of the nutrients in your juice so end result with this is a nutrient rich juice versus uh, with a traditional juicer they create a lot of heat and friction which actually kills off a lot of like the enzymes in the fruit and gives you just sort of like a half ass juice so let's give us a go we're gonna be keeping all the nutrients in and i can't wait um, i'm so I, i've been dying to try this out but i've been waiting to try it with you guys so i think i'm just gonna make my standard juice but i couldn't get any kale um this does come with a lovely like recipe books and like a whole juice cleanse like detox i think it's like a plan anyway uh it's really cool but my grocery store did not have any kale uh, or any of my favourite things really so I'm just going to prepare all the usual suspects and get them ready to go in this. I've not used this yet, like I said, I've been waiting to do it with you guys so I've already washed all the bits and pieces. Let's get a set up, I'm so excited! <laughs>
we're just going to figure this out together. Now, I assume that the juice comes out of the spout in the front, so I'm going to put that there. But I might just actually keep that shut for a minute because I'm under the impression that the juice like fills up from in here, so we'll see. And then this, I think, is like the pulp. So. <laughs> I don't know how loud this is going to be, so I might end up just putting some music over this. Oh my gosh, let's do it! Alright. Let's do it. Oh, it's so quiet. Okay. Oh my god, it's so quiet! Alright. I guess we start with the apple, huh? Oh my god, that is amazing! <laughs> so cool how you can see you can see exactly what's happening I didn't zoom you guys in I'm like I'm so impressed and the juice does come out how about that can you see that subscribe to the channel if you're not already and let me know what other videos you would like to see thank you so much for watching and i'll see you soon bye <laughs>